Hey guys, I have a grocery haul for, to share with you from Kroger. I went to Kroger this morning, it's Sunday morning, and I picked up um, groceries for the week or the next week and a half. It's $82. So I'll go ahead and jump in and share with you what I got. Over here I got some cilantro and avocado, four nectarines, here's a cucumber, can't barely see that, uh, some cauliflower. I found a recipe I want to try with that. Um, big bag of kale, I love having this on hand. It lasts for ages and I like to cook it down or eat it in a salad. Uh, I found a number of Markdown salads, the Buffalo Ranch, and this is good through, it says the 27th, and today's the 22nd, so that'll be good for the end of the week. I uh, picked up this leafy romaine. We've got until a couple days on that, the 25th, and then this was an Asian sesame salad. Needs to be eaten today, says today's the best uh, best by date. So today or tomorrow, probably today because I'm gonna make a pizza for lunch. Um, okay, some meat. I don't really need it this week, but they were good prices. Got this ground turkey and these chicken drumsticks. They were on sale for 79 cents a pound. And the ground turkey was, I think it was $3.99. I had a dollar off coupon that was expiring today. So $2.99 for a pound of natural ground turkey. So I'll just pop that in the freezer. Same with the drumsticks. I'll split this package up and freeze them. Okay, some things to stock the pantry. Green chilies, some enchilada sauce. I thought I'd make some enchiladas maybe coconut oil. I used some of this like a year or two ago and I liked it and I just never restocked it so um, Kroger had a good deal on that. Uh, some salsa, another a green enchilada sauce, a couple spices I need to restock. There it is, marjoram. I actually got this in a spice jar like combination and I really like it. It's kind of a good um, sort of Italian themed seasoning but it's not the exact same Italian seasoning you use all the time so just to change it up that's a good one it's good on pork chops um, and then herbs de Provence I like using this in various things again just kind of so you're not putting the same exact Italian seasoning on everything uh, and then here we've got refried beans okay um, some snack items for my husband, these cinnamon brown sugar Velveetas, some tortilla chips, a couple frozen items. These were on closeout, so I thought I'd try them, the um, butternut squash. A uh, couple smart ones here, just in case I don't have a lunch, um, and this um, pizza back here, just to have, oops, just to have on hand, uh, should I need that. Frozen lemonade is just a nice treat. Um, got some sweet creamer and cake cups for my husband. He started a new job and kind of trying to figure out what snacks to bring. Uh, got some ice cream here. Caramel candy crunch. I was hungry and that sounded so good. I'll enjoy that. A couple coconut waters, Dr. Pepper and LaCroix. Uh, other items, a couple of these snack medleys. One with pretzels and one with nuts and cranberries a pizza crust in case i want to make a homemade pizza i have some pepperoni and stuff so i'll probably make that and then leave the frozen one in the freezer for a day i need that uh, corn tortillas for those enchiladas and then these are the uncooked flour tortillas sorry it's upside down those are great i buy them every now and then um because they taste really good <laughs> okay so that was everything for 82 dollars um, thank you for watching and I promise I'll have more what's for dinner videos up next week. I was on a business trip so didn't get to post those. Alright, thanks for watching. Bye.